fix that so you don't have my in front of the camera. There we go. Now you can see the mess in my fucking room. Then you can see sweet. No, that's not so good. So welcome back. Today is a busy day for me. I'm actually not feeling that great, so this is gonna be the world's fastest boxy premium unboxing. Uh, Brutus is here too, of course, always. He never leaves, ever. Hi. I had to wait actually. These came uh, a couple of hours ago, but I had to wait because everything was frozen. It is legit. Minus 50 out. Okay, piss off. Thank you. I see sweat in the back. Of the yeah, piss off, dude. Go. So, yeah, when these came in this morning, they were frozen. All four boxes came in. So, I had three base boxes ordered for this month, and they all came in. And because I was, um, I'm just learning a video right now of the comparison to see if they actually kind of follow the quizzes. And yeah, definitely go check that one out. It is loading at the moment. Amazingly, the dogs are being pretty behaved. So if you're looking for a video about my dogs behaving badly, well, one of them's behaving badly. The other one's just chilling out because she's like, she's in, she's going into heat. She's having a female issue. She don't want to deal with him or nothing. I feel her when I'm that time of the month I swear to god it's a good thing I'm single because I tell you so back to the base blah, blah, back to the premium box British your distraction okay go lay down go go I will love on you later stop it this one's pretty good actually <laughs> <Yo>. <laughs> <laughs> Do I do? <laughs> oh my. Stop, Brutus. K enough. <laughs> Sway just thinks we're weird. <laughs> like, look at her face. She's like, why am I stuck with these two? <laughs> so, first thing in my premium box is the best, the best brow kit ever. Billy Dollar Brows. Definitely like gonna take a, a look at this guy. I will review it in a later video. Right now, just because everything is still so frozen, I'm not gonna be like doing a lot of swatches and stuff because the thing with eyeshadows and eyeliners, if you swatch them when they're freezing cold, they just break and they disintegrate. It's not a good situation. So it's kind of nice. We're getting a four piece set. I'm not a huge brow person. Like I tend to use, I tend to use because I put my eyebrows on black. I tend to use the black eyeshadow by Anastasia Beverly Hills. I don't remember the exact name of it right now, but it's the blackest one you can buy from her. And that stuff is like my kryptonite. Like seriously love that stuff. Next up is the Lolita by Kat Von D. K. Me and Kat Von D. I don't know. Don't know about that. I'm probably going in a giveaway because I don't feel like having no more eye infections and stuff. So, you know, we'll just put that one aside. The, this one I was really excited about. The first Solly, the unicorn. I call it unicorn blood because it's like, yeah. It is so pretty. I went and checked it out at Sephora. And yeah, it is just gorgeous it looks like it's on thawing a little bit it still looks like there's a big ice cube up in there so we'll just let that it is still like freezing cold like this glass whoa it's cold like if you put this glass in hot water it would probably shatter right now because it is just that cold the next one up is a Tulu Tula skincare it is a keep it clear and acne foam cleanser I don't really need this. I'm probably gonna like wind up giving this one away or something, like put it in a giveaway. I, I tend to like a lot of like Dr. Brand products. Um, I'm starting to get more into like the glow recipe, like the juice, like the glow recipe stuff in that, mainly because they're sending it to me in Boxy Charm and I'm a cheap asshole who doesn't like to spend money on skincare. But yeah, I'll put that one under my sink and we'll see how it goes. It doesn't expire until July next year so I might just need to use it because I'll run out of stuff so next up I have the bliss ooh mask I love a mask literally I get in the tub every night and I throw one of my bath bombs in it for my bath and beauty line and I put on a face mask and I just float away 
like don't care about anything. I put my little oil warmer on, got some aromatherapy going. Yeah, so definitely this will be fun. Deep, deep detox for clay souffle mask. It's just a fancy name for a mask put in a can for mousse. So definitely that will be a fun one to use. And then this was the one I picked. So <laughs> this is what I really want. This is the whole reason I went kept this damn box because I wanted the Too Faced palette with the sparkly turquoise. I'm just a whore for bright colored eyeshadows. I don't know. I love it. Yes, queen. I dusted this up a little. Never blow on your eyeshadows or anything. It's not sanitary. But check it out. Definitely excited for that one. I can't wait to try this guy out. Definitely, I... I'm happy with this month. Next month I am super excited for, I already know what I'm picking for my next month. So it is, yeah. I'm definitely going for that hair straightener next month. I like how that BoxyCharm is letting you choose between an eyeshadow palette and like an actual like product or stuff like that because I find I have so much makeup. Like I have so much makeup it's ridiculous but i was seriously lacking in the skincare products besides the stuff that i make and everything before i signed up for boxycharm like i would never go to sephora and buy like a glow recipe this came in my base box so no, no. but yeah so i would never go buy this myself because i'm too cheap and everything so yeah but the fact that they're putting it in there is awesome. Like I never even used Dr. Brand products before and now I'm like, I, just, I love Dr. Brand products. Like they're so great. So yeah, it's definitely, um, it's a good box for this month. It's kind of like, wah, wah. like it's not, oh my God. I think definitely the base box kind of overdid it for me this month because it had the Too Faced highlighter. It had the eyeshadow palettes, like, and I ordered three of them, so realistically, every single item that was in the base boxes, I got, which was kind of nice. I think I only had three doubles out of all three boxes. So you definitely go check out the other video, me unboxing all three boxes. Also, I have launched my Bath & Beauty Lion on Shopify now. It is SBS, goes, stands for Sweet Bella Spa, um, SBS Be Bath & Beauty dot Shopify dot com. I have all my bath bombs on there, my lip bombs, my lip bombs. Honestly, I'm amazed I have any in stock right now because every winter I make lip balm and every winter all my girlfriends hoard my house and ask for 50 of these things and I just like cannot keep them in. They're great. They have essential oils in them. My lavender, it gives you like kind of that boost of like, oh, like the smell is amazing. The tea tree oil is one I use. So I use the baby, it has tea tree oil. They are organic and vegan lip balms. There's nothing in them, or it's nothing is tested on every single product I use to make them. Every eating ingredient I use to make the products is either vegan, cruelty free, well, all cruelty free, vegan or organic. As much as I can get it vegan, it, and organic I, I get it like that's why my price point it's a little higher but that's just because literally I'm making like off of every bath bomb I make bath bombs are five dollars I'm not even making a dollar off the bath bombs because it is high quality ingredients the only thing in the bath bomb that is not organic is the baking soda everything else is I can buy cheaper products I can make bath bombs for 25 cents and pump them out like other stores do but I don't feel like with all the chemicals in the world now, we need to bring them into your house. On another side note, somebody here has actually ate my bath bombs and not gotten sick. So that tells you right there how pure they are. And yeah, so, but I don't recommend it. He's a hundred pounds. He could really like eat a rotting corpse and it wouldn't affect him. He could eat half a chocolate store. It would not affect him. I love you too. It's my baby. I honestly, he's getting old and he's getting little gray hairs. Can you see the little gray hairs? Little gray hairs. Little gray hairs. I don't know what I'm going to do with him when he's gone. 
like without him he's just such my boo so. but thank you so much for coming by guys definitely go check out my store it is definitely well worth it and yeah thank you so much guys have a good day